Hello, my name is Jason Chanko and I'm the Applications Marketing Manager at Siglent Technologies. I had a customer call a few days ago and asked me if there was a way to visually, in, or visually measure the audio output from a spectrum analyzer, the, the demodulated output. Here, uh, the uh, SSA series as well as our other spectrum analyzers do have a 3.5 millimeter audio output. Uh, and that can be run to a separate speaker and they can do demodulation but that's an audio signal directly so if we want to visually see what's happening we're going to be able to or we need to do we need to measure the voltage output in order to see if we're clipping or if we have any other issues with our transmitter itself so I figured this would be a pretty neat little video um, so I have a, a telescopic antenna I'm gonna tune the spectrum analyzer center frequency to a local radio station here in Ohio so let's go to 92.3 megahertz so now we've got that center frequency. We're going to change the span to one meg. We're gonna change the bandwidth to 100K. And that's going to cover a very large area uh, of the modulation as well as the digital channels that we have on this FM radio station. So you'll see I'm not actually picking up anything. So I'm gonna to go to amplitude. I'm gonna disable the attenuator. I'm gonna set that to zero dB. Now we'll see the actual output of that transmitter and then uh, we'll also turn the preamplifier on. Now we've got that center frequency uh, so this is the FM modulated signal coming in and now we're going to set the marker to the center and we'll turn on the DMOD. Uh, so here I've pressed the DMOD button we're at uh, DMOD off let's turn it to FM and then we'll turn on the earphone and now you can hear the, uh, the radio station itself. And so now we've got that audio output. Now I'm just going to make a quick change here. We'll turn this down a little bit. I'll make a quick change here, just a second. I'm gonna replace this speaker with a, uh, with a probe from the oscilloscope and connect that up to the oscilloscope. So just one moment. All right, so now I've connected the oscilloscope up to a three and a half millimeter. I just terminated the wire and stripped it, uh, connected up the scope probe itself. And now we can take a look at what's going on over here on the oscilloscope as far as our audio. So I'm just adjusting. And so now we're seeing that audio in real time. We can shrink that time base a little bit and get a little bit of a faster update. And so now we're seeing the audio in real time. So we could check and see if we're getting flat top, if we have some kind of clipping from the audio. Uh, we could also do some offline analysis of that voltage. So uh, in order to visualize the output, uh, the demodulated output from a spectrum analyzer, you simply need an oscilloscope, uh, do a little bit of butchering on a, uh, on a three and a half millimeter cable, and you should be all set. Thank you very much. I hope that was a helpful hint for you all. Uh, if you have any questions, please contact your local Siglent office and have a great day. Take care.